Jacob, that must be a really hard one to take. How's everybody feeling in there? Um, yeah, obviously everyone's a bit down. I think we, we deserved the three points tonight. I think everything was kind of against us. And um, the boys played so well. Um, so to concede in the, at the end like that was obviously tough to take. But um, it's a point in the right direction. Um, and we've got to take that kind of performance um, into Saturday. It's the cliche thing to say that it, it must feel like a defeat. Is it important that you hang on to that positive stuff and, and the fact that you've come here and got a point and performed so well? I think so, yeah. Um, obviously, the three points would have been, would have been really good. Um, but sometimes when you come to, to big, bigger, big clubs, with a big stadium, big crowd, um, some things just don't go for you. Um, and they put the pressure on at the end. Um, and we were holding out and then that corner bobbles around the box and, and he puts it in. It's tough to take, but we, we have to take the point and move on. Probably could, maybe should have had a penalty at 1-0. There's a sense of frustration, I know, from the manager about that. Did it feel like that frustration built as the game went on? Um, I don't know what I can say, to be honest. Um, there was a couple of decisions, I think, that, that didn't go our way. And sometimes that happens um, in the game. But um, as a team, we just have to, have to move forward and, and try and get used to some of the refereeing in this <laughs> As far as the way you, you're being asked to play since the manager changed, it's very different, isn't it? How much adapting is there having to be done? And, and physically, how difficult is it out there? Um, I think when you come to, to clubs that are higher up in the league, it's always going to be tough anyway. Um, the manager wants to build a solid base, um, which I think tonight we, we showed that base. They only had to, they hit the bar in the first half, but I can't remember anything else in the game, really, that, that troubled uh, Trev and goal. So... It's not much getting used to. I think it's something that obviously the manager was here last year, so a lot of the boys know the way he wants to play and the, um, the kind of team and, and spirit he wants to create. I know defenders and I know how much pride you take in doing your job and putting your body on the line and stopping the ball going in and there. Is that solid base the thing that can give you real encouragement about staying up? I think so, yeah. If you, if you look tonight, I think um, with, with Tombs in front of, of the back three like we had, I think we were, we were pretty solid and, and we kind of were seeing the game through. Obviously, they had a lot of possession second half. As the game went on as well, they started to uh, put more and more pressure on, but I never felt like they were um, massively on top and they were going to score. So I think, um, yeah, it, it showed well tonight, I think. For a long time, you were out with the relegation zone because you were winning the game. Obviously, the point instead of three makes a difference there. How confident do you feel that, that you can get out of this? I'm pretty confident. We've got a, a very good team. Um, we've got players on the bench like Jonah, John, and the people that came on today. Um, the, the quality in the squad is, is there. And I think even since I've been here, since January, there's been games where we think, oh, how have we not won that? Um, so we've just got to keep, keep pushing, keep believing in each other, sticking together. And um, yeah, I think we can get out of the situation we're in. And the, the games coming up are um, obviously really important against teams that aren't higher up in the table. Yeah, how important is that? Because there's been so many kind of what-if moments, even in the time you've been with the club. It, it's crucial. Is it crucial that you've just got to get over the line and win one now? Um, we've got, I think, 10 games left. Um, so it's not panic stations yet. Um, we've, got to, we've got to keep a kind of head about us. And... Um, Going into Saturday at home with our fans behind us, um, we've, got to, we've got to be positive about getting a result there. I think we've been very resolute and got, got a fair few points, draws, but hopefully we can turn those into wins at home. So, And from a personal point of view, <laughs> throwing it at the deep end springs to mind. How much have you enjoyed it? How much are you learning every day? Yeah, it's been really good, to be fair. Um, it's exactly what I wanted to, um, to get when I came into the club. Obviously, when um, Robbo was here, um, I knew the position we were in, but it's, it's the learning curve and, and the games that you want as a young player playing at a stadium like this, Plymouth on, on Saturday, and then the home games with the atmosphere with everyone bunched in. It's um, what every kind of boy wants to do when they're young, play in front of crowds and play for something. So it's been really good, yeah. <laughs>